What's up everybody? Well, I got another unboxing video for you guys today. And today, I will hopefully have my new 5090 in there, in this box. Now, I wanted a 5090 Astral, don't ask me why, probably because I'm clinically insane, but that's the one I wanted, so I held out and did not settle like I did with the rest of my GPUs. I wanted the 4090 Strix last time, but that was hard to get too, so I was like, eh. So now I decided, no, I'm getting the one I want this time. I can hold my horses. I've got two 4090s. It's not like either one of them is so slow I can't game. So we're good. We can hold our horses. So ordered it off of, uh, I thought Amazon, but I guess it was Newegg, unless they just repurposed a Newegg box at their place, but that seems a little weird. I'm willing to bet I got it off of Newegg, and that's why they used USPS too. I was wondering why they didn't just use Amazon and had it be here in a couple days. So let's not blab anymore, and let's see if I got a box full of rocks, just some random GPU, maybe some bricks, who knows? Or did I get exactly what I ordered? Now, I got it right from Newegg. It wasn't a third-party seller or anything like that. I checked, so it shouldn't be unless somebody in the, you know, Shipping area was like, ooh, I could resell this for like five, six grand. I don't care about my job. I'm gonna go steal this. Who knows? I don't know what goes on. So why don't I shut the fuck up? I'm sure you guys wanna see this card. So let's go get to unboxing. All right, let's get to unboxing. And of course, we've gotta have a cool knife to do so. And me, I'm a sucker for Damascus. So got this thing. This is a cheapo, like 30 or $40 knife I got off Amazon. But there we go. Seal is now cut. Truth be told, I could probably just have cut those with my fingernails, but it is what it is. So there's that, let's close that so I don't cut myself or if Misty jumps up, she doesn't get hurt. And let's get to unboxing this thing. All right, it's got a bunch of packaging. All right, well, holy shit, this thing's heavy. But yeah, that's what it's supposed to be. So let's uh, give Misty this box because she sure is eyeballing it. And then I can set this down before I drop this thing and pull a Linus. Here you go, Misty. Just don't choke on none of those plastic puffy things. She loves those things full of air. She hasn't had those in forever, so she's probably ecstatic. But anyway, let's have a quick look around the box before we actually get it out of there. So obviously we got the 5090, RG Astral, the Quad Van Force. I, I gotta love the freaking things they use to brag and advertise. We got 32 gigs of RAM. Obviously I can't test ROPs and see if we've got the correct ROPs or not. Let's see, was it ever opened? It got a little damaged, but it still never opened. So I don't really care if it got a little damaged, it's just a box. And then on this side, we just got that. So I think besides the back here, we can take a quick look at that. It's got three years warranty, but good luck getting warranty from them. They'll probably go, nope, the box is broken there. That's gonna be $200. <laughs> I don't know though. I've never had a problem with them. I can't, yeah, they're the only ones I ever had to send something in. Actually, you know, there was an MSI too, and I had no problem with that. Motherboard burnt up on me in the past. Anyway though, I think that's more than good enough. People have had their fair share of what's going on on the box here, I think. Hopefully you guys can read all that. I'll give you another second now that I move it a little closer and we'll refocus. I don't have autofocus anymore. Turning that off is the best thing I ever did, but it does get a little annoying for, you know, unboxing videos. I could just turn it back on, but then I know my stoned ass will leave it on. Anyway, I think that's more than good enough. Let's get to actually unboxing this thing, shall we? All right, let's get to getting this thing open. What do I do with that knife? Because we've got another seal to break here, or at least it looks like it. Huh, where does that seal actually seal? Oh, I see, I see it. It was so freaking sealed. I couldn't tell. There we go. I'm gonna say, oh, I mean, some box is already broken. I will just completely tear you out of there to get to you if I have to. Alrighty. Now, let's ugh, do it the good old fashioned way here. This is so much easier than struggling with it and all that nonsense. As long as it doesn't tip over, that is. Alrighty. It almost looks like a shoe box, to be honest with you. For those who dare. Well, I dared. So let's open this thing up and see what we get. All right, well, that's a nice presentation. I should turn it so you guys can see it. This box is tall. They give you a little thing there. So let's see what we get. Lots of foam too. So that's always good. So what do we get in this box first? I know you guys probably want me to just get to the actual card, but we'll get there. And of course, I'm gonna have chapters so you guys can just skim around. All right, do you slide out of here or what? Looks like it's supposed to slide, but I don't really care. I'm just gonna break it. I have no patience for this kind of nonsense. All right. Huh. No, I'm struggling here. Is that it? No, there's still more in here. Here we go. We got it to slide out now. Sucks that I broke it a little bit, but it is what it is. It's not like I'm ever going to put it back together and resell it or anything. And then you've got all of your quick start guides and stuff in here. What do we got? In search of incredible graphics card holder, how to use it. A thank you. Well, that's nice of them, seeing as though I spent so much money. And then how to plug the little plugs in properly. But nobody really cares about any of that. So let's just get all of that out of the way. And let's see what we get in here. 
Well, that's actually kind of cool. They give you a, a ruler. So that's kind of neat. Obviously not the most useful thing for me, but that's still really cool. What else do we got in here? Looks like maybe a, I don't know, like a, it's got Velcro and stuff. Might be like a cable thing or something like that, I would guess. But it's got Velcro and stuff, so I'm imagine, imagining it goes like that, but. We got that, you get your little octopus cable here. I'm not gonna use that, obviously. So you don't get the cool bendable one you get with the other stuff. Oh, you get like a little, what do they call it? Like a little coin, that's kind of cool too. They're giving you some halfway cool stuff with this thing. You've got your graphics card holder, which I think it's metal or hard plastic, but either way, it'll hold your GPU up. So let me get a better focus for you guys. All right, and then last but not least, they give you a little keyboard uh, thing here that looks like your GPU. And they do spin. But obviously I'm not gonna take off any of my ceramic caps for that, but it's still a cool little add-on they gave us. Here we go, let's focus back on the thing that matters the most, the GPU. So now let's get that out of there. And there it is, holy crap, that's a chonky card. Come on out of there, you. I don't really know where to freaking grab on this thing, but there we go, in the bag and whatnot. So now let's get this box out of here. I don't really think there's anything else in here. All right, let's open this thing up and see what's what. Although I should probably stop the video real quick too, just in case I mess up. That way I don't lose all that footage. Can't put it back in the bag and all that, you know? All right, now let's actually get this thing out of the bag. This thing is a absolute just behemoth of a card. I'm kind of glad they made it so it comes out of the wrap this way. And there it is in all of its glory. Let's see, let's focus again. Here we go. Yeah, it definitely feels very premium. It's absolutely thick as hell. Obviously, I don't want to drop the dang thing. There's all your ports and whatnot. It even has two HDMI ports. How cool is that? And then there's the top. And then there's the back with its little extra fan and whatnot. Hey, Misty, don't jump up there right now. Go back and have fun with your uh, whatchamacallits. Come here, you. I know she's probably gonna get mad at me. I know, you wanna go and explore, but I'm busy making a video. But all right, let me take the camera off real quick and we can get probably better shots. So sorry if it's a little... Because I wanna get good shots, you know? But it might be a little shaky. It's even got a spot where something can connect there probably to hold it up. Oh, almost crashed myself right into a uh, one of my lights. That wouldn't have been good. All right. And that's pretty much that. So I think we can put you guys back in your little holder there. Refocus, there we go. And that's pretty much that. So now I've gotta go make a different video of me building a computer, because now I can finally build my computer. But I'm gonna upload this unboxing video. There weren't too many unboxing videos of this card. It's a pretty rare damn thing, that's for sure. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm super excited, I actually got my Astral. It was not a box of rocks, so hell yeah. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video, because I sure as hell enjoyed making it for you guys. And until the next video, Peace out, guys.